What's up, everybody? It's your boy, Big Mike, and I am back with another Bama versus the World SEC Championship Edition, uh, where Alabama takes on Georgia this Saturday uh, and for the SEC Championship and the right for hopefully go to the playoff. Uh, we will check in with Mr. Georgia and Mr. Bama. Uh, we will bring in first, as we do every week. Mr. Bama, come on in. How are you doing today? I'm doing fantastically splendid on this beautiful Wednesday evening, Mike. How are you doing? I'm doing good. How's your heart after after last Saturday? Is after still the, good? After the fourth and one, fourth and thirty-one, it took some time to kind of get over that and, and realize what happened. Uh, even after the play immediately happened, I was still in yes absolute uh, I shock. Was... I, I didn't even know how to react, so it was real <laughs> strange. But uh, Sunday afternoon, I think I kind of came grips with came to grips with everything, and I realized we actually won and everything was legal. So we, we move on. Yeah, hopefully they wouldn't take it back the day after. Yeah, that yeah. would have been crazy. Uh, but as it is, it is championship week against uh, the 29-game win streak, back-to-back <laughs> -back national champion, Georgia Bulldogs. Uh, so we will also bring in Mr. Bulldog, Mr. Jo Mr. Georgia. How are you doing today, Mr. Georgia? Hello, peasants. Uh, just be glad that I've graced you with a moment of my time. I'm very busy winning championships over here, um, just like Alabama used to do. Uh, before they got old so wow and can we uh can we hurry this up i've got a lot of things to do i'll just be glad that i've even bothered with you guys Let's move along. Uh, all right oh so in, in lieu of mr georgia being in a hurry mr Bamman, we'll start with you as we always do uh, <laughs> what, what are you looking forward to uh any keys to the game this saturday Basically, how bad do you think we're going to beat you this weekend? Is what he's saying. He's just putting it in a nice way. Go ahead. I'm sorry. I'm looking. Say that. Yeah, I'm looking for us to try to capitalize on Georgia's slow starts. <laughs> if you watch, even if you watch any of this. <laughs> Oh, we're starting off with comedy. So I'm, I'm sorry. Well, we Mr. Respect. Georgia, in, in in reference of time, since you said you were in a hurry, yeah. um, good refrain yes. from interrupting. Mr. Well, I just Ramsey. didn't realize we were going to start off with jokes. But I apologize. Go ahead. Let's, let's pretend okay. like you have a Georgia's chance. Georgia's known to get off to somewhat of a slow start on offense. Okay. Uh, usually they usually the other team might score first, but they'll come back and obviously win their games. But uh, if we could capitalize oh. and kind of get up. Yeah, no, I'm just on something where these Alabama guys. Okay, if we could kind of score a touchdown on our first drive yeah, or at no, least the first I mean, touchdown in the game, I think really, that'll give us a good cushion. No, and we could just work with that. At least three touchdowns. Easy, yeah. Okay. And, All right, no problem. Okay, he's not listening, but okay. So I'm sorry, were you saying something important? Every Look, just because he's not listening doesn't mean everybody else in Alabama Nation isn't. Right. Uh, so I appreciate that analysis. Uh, we will. You guys still have fans. To... I figured everyone jumped off the bandwagon after we took over. But go ahead. I'm, I'm sorry. We will shift gears to Mr. Georgia. I, 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 I'm almost afraid to ask this question, but what are you looking forward to uh, in the game against Alabama on Saturday? Making uh, Saban retire after the game, uh, having him hand Hello. the crown over to. Uh, Kirby Smart at, at, at the middle of the field on one knee. I mean, this will just be the most glorious coronation of all time. And then I guess afterwards we can go win the whole national championship too, I guess. But uh, I will relish this weekend. Oh. Mm. All right. I'm there, sorry. There you go. Yes. Uh, that, that's, that's a very, very interesting answer. A lot, a lot of not sure exactly what to make of it. Um you know, both teams did make of it. Alabama's last week. old news. Georgia is is up and coming. Back back to back. I, I guess I might have to write in back to back yep. to back somewhere in there after this year. So. You're right. You you guys have one back to back national championship. So we do we do respect you guys for that. that. And, and know know that it's going to be a big challenge. Um, but Mr. Bama, what do you what do you think? I know obviously the slow start. You mentioned that. I got a um, question, Mr. Bama. How does it feel to not be good anymore? Like, do you remember being good, or has it been so long since that happened that you just have forgotten all about that? We'll revisit this conversation after you guys lose on Saturday. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> oh, please. Right. So, Mr. Bama, going into the game, you know, you mentioned the slow starts. What is yeah. the what is the one thing? Um, that, that you guys need to do on Saturday to, to make sure you come out with a victory. Make sure you it's leave early come to down beat to Milrow. And, Oh, sorry. It's going to come down to Milrow and his decisiveness on the, on, on the, on the ball. Um, he's going to have to make super smart, fast decisions. Ooh, good luck. Allow him to hold the ball for four to five seconds and eat the yeah. take sacks. And More like a half a second. Fumble or, or have sacks. any, you know, ridiculous Fumbles. penalties. So um, if he could. Oh, so, was I saying that out loud? Got, He's I'm also going to have to work on I'm moving sorry. the ball up the field and not just relying on the deep ball, too. Yeah, which he won't get on right. that secondary, but that's fine anyway. Well, I, I know we've we've kind of heard some of the running commentary from Mr. Georgia during 
during Mr. Bama's time, but we, we will mm-hmm. still ask the question. And, and, Look, and all as the star of this side, little whatever uh, show you've got going on, I figure everybody's tuning in to see more of me anyway. But well, go ahead, uh, Michael. That's not necessarily uh, – Thank you for using my whole name, I guess. That seems weird. <laughs> um, I didn't think I was in trouble. Um, but when, so what is the one thing that you guys need to do uh, from a Georgia perspective to, to make sure you guys come out Saturday with a victory? Show up. I mean, wow. pretty sure we can win this with our second second stringers, but first stringers, I guess they'll get some good yardage too. The but just show up. Guy. If, we're, if we're there, we win. So, you know. Okay. So with that being said, we will get right into predictions. That way, Mr. Georgia can get along with all the busy stuff he's got going on. Mr. Georgia, what do you I'm just in high demand. The score? Something you guys would never know anything about, but, like, people want us around, you know? Kind of like Alabama used to be. So, so Mr. Georgia, what, what do you predict? That, uh, <laughs> should be interesting. Yeah. What do you predict the score will be on Saturday? Uh, Maybe 41-3. to three. Wow. Okay, 41 to 3. And I'm, I'm going to, just for clarification, I'm going to guess you have Georgia winning 41 to 3 from everything you've said. I just want to verify that Michael, that's the truth. Michael. I understand. I know you're a Georgia fan, Michael. but it is it is my job look to at me. Look at me. Of course. I, I have no choice but to look at you. You're on, you're on the screen. Yeah, it's um, unfortunate. Uh, we, we will swap over to Mr. Bama. Um, Mr. Bama, what is your score prediction for the game Saturday? Kind of ironic. I'm going to go with has a face like a bulldog. But go ahead. I'm sorry. Go ahead. Go ahead. Wow. That's... Whoa. Let's go ahead. Wow. I'm listening. I'm pretending to listen. Watch. I'll be interested in what you say. You're giving me the home alone face. Wow. Okay. Uh, I'm going to go with 35 30. Um, I don't think we're, it's going to be hard to stop Georgia from scoring, but I think impossible. Keep them but that's fine. Between 25 30 points and just give us a slight edge and uh, give us the victory. All right, there you go, 35 to 30 from Mr. Bama. Um, and obviously, I'll ask the same question. You do are assuming Alabama is the 35, yes. and you will. All right, and so you are assuming Alabama will win. So there we yes. go. Uh, a little bit closer game. Is that than 35 Jordan's in, like, five games, or are you picking that in one game, just for clarification? Oh, my gosh, this guy is really getting on my well, nerves. Uh, you would think it's back-to-back national mm-hmm. champions. You, you would know how this works. You only get scored for one game. Yeah, um, but you know how Alabama people are. Question. They're not really good at math, so, you know, they might be, you know. Doing whatever okay. they usually do. Um, yes, I, I'm. I, I've been called out on the show for not being, not being fair and biased. So I'm going to keep all comments to myself, even though. Don't worry, Mike. I see you. I fans. see you. Yes. I, thank you. I appreciate yeah. that. Um, he has no choice we, but to we see you. You're on the screen. <laughs> uh, you're right. I, I did mention that. Um, this guy must have been Georgia Tech. Whoa! Them fighting uh, words. Them uh, fighting words. We, we think we'll see you uh, Mr. Saturday. You okay. will. Um, we'll, we'll see you Saturday. Uh, may the best team win. Um, that's Alabama. Which is us, but that's uh, fine. Yeah. Uh, but we uh, we appreciate coming in. Appreciate your very valuable time, Mr. Georgia. Mr. Rim, it's always good to see you. Um, yes, hopefully everybody has a great game Saturday. And as always, roll tide. Roll tide. Go dogs. <laughs>